hello, 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 guys. Welcome, welcome, and thank you so much for listening to my Orange Mix. Uh, this particular session, guys, we're going to be talking about being able to act, A-C-T, making a difference in our lives through some tips and techniques through Mr. Orange. Guys, hold on tight, because we're going to have some fun. Things that's held us down But now it looks like things are finally coming around I know we've got a long, long way to go And where we'll end up, I don't know But we won't let nothing hold us back We're putting our shirts together We're polishing up our act And if you've ever been held down before I know you refuse to be held down anymore. Okay, guys. So, 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 let's get moving. Um, if you'd have listened to my Facebook Live or maybe my Instagram talk, I spoke about the bulb comes on when requested, but there must be a time when the bulb doesn't come on. So what are you going to do about it? Very important. Okay, so what do I mean? Um, this is a true story, actually. This happened to me about two weeks ago. Um, I turned my light switch on, and all of a sudden I heard ping, and the bulb had gone. That was it. It was blown. Now, before I changed it, I just looked closely at the bulb, and I just realized that life is as fragile as that. I think it was uh, Elton John said of uh, Lady Di, she lives her life like a candle in the wind. And I think it's important that we learn to act before obviously something like that does happen. So guys, when we're looking at what we can do about it, when those things occur, yeah? I did actually say, and it's quite interesting really, I said, you know, what we do about it when this happens. I mean, really when it happens, there's not a lot you can do about it. But I'm talking about when that bulb goes. You've got to be able to do what you need to do in your life now before that time happens. Now, not sounding morbid, not sounding negative, but the reality is we don't know how long we've got on this planet. And for me, one of the things I was saying in my talk is, so now is the time to act. A C T. I will say I, I do believe we are living in a world where we're spoiled. My daughter's seven, my boys are in their twenties. And I don't think they knew what I went through. Now this isn't a sub story by any stretch of imagination. But what I'm saying is that things were a lot different when I was younger. And I think nowadays you can access anything instantly from your smartphone. So what am I saying? I believe nowadays the generation are spoilt. Yeah, they are spoilt. And Ben E.E. E. King will tell you about being spoilt. Love this tune, guys. Enjoy.
Okay, Benny E. Okay, Benny E. King. I keep struggling to say Benny E. King for some reason. Um, what's really important, and like I stated earlier, I do believe we are spoiled. I think we don't realise how fortunate we are, and I think it's all about realising, all about realising that we've got many enough, many things in our lives. It's about realising that it's about what you do with it, and that's the key, isn't it? It's so what you do with it, and I think thinking about more and more about what you achieve in life is about you having a reflection of where you are and gratitude is very important so guys let's get going as i said act a c t is what we're looking at a is for account for accountability now i spoke about this in my talk and i said one of the most important things is is that you must be accountable must be accountable for your actions now it's very easy to be accountable for yourself. However, do you actually put it into practice? I told the story about Oprah Winfrey. It's reported that you know the, the, way she, the reason she lost so much weight was about accountability. Why? Because when she got together every two weeks, she was amongst people that were looking to see if she had lost weight, just like she was looking at other people as well. So the power of accountability is so important. So what am I asking you to do? Yes, I am trying to find, I want you to try to find people that make you accountable for what you're going to change in your life. It's very important. But what's most of important of all is for you to be accountable for yourself. I did do a, a quote, which I think Gandhi once said, that uh, the way you do anything is how you do everything. The small things that you say you're going to do, you must do. If you don't, it's that letting down yourself. And one of the things I think is important is that it's about you realising you have to support yourself. Yeah, And it's very, very important. So, let's move on. With that, guys, I'm in, I'm in a bit of a rare groove mode, you might have noticed. And uh, as I was stating about accountability, because if you don't account for yourself, there's no point in sending out an SOS for help. Because you could be in trouble. Guys, let's go! Rocket!
Okay, that was Side Effects SOS. Yeah, there is no point in sending out an SOS, you know, if you're not going to be accountable for yourself. So look very carefully about really making account for your accountability. Who are you going to elect as people that could be your accountability partners? Why is this so important? Because if you're going to make any change, I think you've got to start changing the way you behave. And maybe you don't feel that you have anyone you can trust. So what's your job? You've got to find someone you can trust, find a coach um, to make a difference for yourself. But you have to try something different. What's that saying that Dr. Wayne Dyer once said? For things to change, you must change. Right, that is A. Let's now move to C. Now C is really important. And I want you to think very hard about what C could be. Um, C is about cancelling something, but before I tell you, we're going to talk about how hard it is to meet someone like you. Woo, we love it. Bell and the Drells. Love that tune. Hard not to like you. Thank you. Right, so let's just move on a little bit now. I said about C, gave you a clue, is to cancel. Basically what it is, is to cancel your subscription to distractions. Now, what does that mean? Um, I believe in this society we live in, we have subscribed to something we don't even know about. And basically, it's to basically social media and all of the trappings that comes around things that are distracting us. Now, what I want to start doing is thinking of how you can think of ways to focus a lot 
more and not be distracted by obviously all of the stuff we all we often often see and so i think it's one of those things you've got to be aware of that it's about you being able to say right i accept that i've subscribed to social media and the news and how you can filter out your subscriptions does that make sense so it's kind of looking at your time and i often talk about this is planning your day before it starts yeah trying to get some kind of control in what you're doing in your day because if you don't what tends to happen is your day just drifts and uh, it's just so difficult so guys think so much about that think a lot about that i should say and really think of the differences you can make by planning your day before it starts also trying to look at the stress distractions you've got and how you can Develop a greater focus for each day that you're given because, you know, I always say every day above ground is a, is a great day. Why? Because it's all about realizing like that bulb, things can just fire out just like that. So it's so important. And whilst you think about this, guys, I want to put you to Andy Blair, Blair, I should say, following the rare groove movement. Let's go. Enjoy. next to you you guys as you know i'm pushing the whole rare groove thing and i just love it um let's move to t guys t is about time travel what am i talking about guys i just want you to imagine getting into a machine and programming it 10 years ahead and then when you get there getting out and just seeing yourself 10 years time are you where you would like to be are you looking at that image and thinking, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, that's great, I'm happy about that? Or are you kind of thinking, oh my gosh, I need to get back into that machine, man, and get back? Because if you are thinking that, it's not a bad thing, because I think a lot of us don't set goals. And a lot of us in a situation, especially now, it's just about just getting maybe through this situation rather than getting from it, which for me, it's about learning every experience, but I do know how difficult it is at the moment. So just imagine in that time machine, 10 years ahead, are you where you want to be? Now, if you're not... You're going to have a problem, yeah? And I mean, that is a fact. So what do we have to do? We've got to look at, I think, picking up from where you're at at the moment and just looking at the distance. What's the distance? What has to change? What what must be moved? In other words, you know, what vibrations must you generate in order to generate the life you need? The vibrations of the team. What do you think about of the track? What do you think about, guys? Listen carefully to this, guys. Vibrations is gold. Shake it up.
Shaking it up, guys, the vibration. So, guys, it's so important what I've spoken about regarding getting ready to act. And it's about accounting for accountability, cancel your subscription distractions, and time travel yourself 10 years ahead. Are you where you want to be? Now, you know, I talk about this all the time, but one of the things you've got to bear, bear in mind is that if you're not where you are, you have to take some action. You've probably heard me many a time say that the best thing to do is the right thing, the next thing is to do is the wrong thing, but the worst thing to do is nothing. With all of these listenings, I, uh, all of these audios I put together, it's all about you hopefully enjoying the music, but also understanding the message. It's not about getting through this, it's about getting from this. And guys, as I always do, I'm going to finish with a man, Mr. LV. Mr. LV, take it away. I hope you've enjoyed the show. Thank you very much indeed. Whee! so much for listening in i hope you are enjoying these mixes guys you can pick them up on youtube um orange online learning just go to youtube orange online learning and you'll be able to see plenty more mixes thanks again guys and take care of yourself